Wait, you're a Bears fan and you're not subscribed to my channel? Before this video starts, make sure to 1. Hit the subscribe button below to catch all Bears content right here on this podcast. 2. Hit the bell notification because you, my friend, are a diehard Bears fan. And 3. Like this video and tell all the Bears fans you know about the channel. Alright, that's better. Now that you're actually subscribed to the channel, make sure to bear down and enjoy this video. Hey, what's going on, Bears fans? Thank you so much for joining me for another episode of Keek on the Mic, the podcast all about the Chicago Bears. Before I get this episode started, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell notification to catch all Bears content right here on the podcast. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram page at Keek on the Mic. And make sure you share this episode of Keek on the Mic with every single Bears fan that you know. As you can see today, we have a special guest. She holds a special place in my heart. And honestly, after today's video, she's probably going to hold a special place in all Bears fans across America. It is my fiance, Madison. How you doing, babe? Good. This is your first time being on this new podcast. You you were on my old podcast, but this is your first time on the Chicago Bears podcast. How are you feeling? Good. All your subscribers are going to like me more than they like you. <laughs> Comment down below, just by first looks. Do you like me better or her? <laughs> All right. So we have a fun little episode planned here today. Madison agreed to come on and try to guess Bears players, coaches, past and present, because Maddie, through, throughout the years, uh, she has slowly been learning uh, Bears trivia, all about the Bears players, the history of the Chicago Bears. So she wanted to come on and try to guess these players and coaches, et cetera, past and present. So are you feeling confident? A little bit, but just like disclaimer, I'm not the – biggest football fan out there i i enjoy it because bubba enjoys it <laughs> yes uh, just a little backstory madison is not a huge football fan uh, before we started dating about six years ago now she was actually a denver broncos fan mm -hmm. and tell them the story about why you were a broncos fan because my fifth grade crush was a broncos yeah. fan <laughs> yeah so that's a great you know you know how most people say oh i'm a bears fan because of walter payton i'm a bears fan because of this she was a Broncos fan because of a fifth grade crush. So it was only appropriate that when we officially got engaged a couple months ago that she officially became a Chicago Bears fan. So today we're going to go through these Bears players and maybe some coaches past and present and she's going to try to guess all of them. And I'm pretty confident, but just a disclaimer <laughs> for you guys Bears fans. Don't give her a hard time if she gets some key Bears players wrong because like she said, She's not totally invested like we are in the Chicago Bears. Not at all. <laughs> not at all. So this would be fun. So I'm going to shrink us right now, and you're going to be able to see them um, on the big screen. And if you want to try to guess them too, I'm pretty sure all you guys will get 100% on this test. Um, should we do like a little wager right here? No. Like if you get like at least half right, I'll take you out to dinner or something. But if you get like less than half right, you take me out to dinner. Okay. If I get half right or more, then you buy lunch. Oh, buy lunch. So there's 15. So I need to get seven right. Yeah. So you need to get seven or more right. If you get yeah. six or less, well, if you get six or seven or less, yeah. less than seven, then you take me out to my lunch of choice. Okay. Deal? Shake it. Noggin. Ready? Ow. Dude. <laughs> all right, here we go. I'm going to put them on the screen, and here we go. This one is – this one's an easy one, all right? This one is just a warm-up round. So here we go. Staley. Who? <laughs> Staley. Staley the what? The bear. Staley the bear. Oh. Remember, in Chicago, as a Bears fan, babe, you have to remember everything is the Bears, not the Bears. It's okay. the Bears. So but it's Staley. Staley, good okay. job. Ding, ding, ding. All right. That was a warm one. I was, I was like, if she gets this wrong, we're just going to stop this episode right here. So, yes, this is Staley the, Staley the Bear. I want to hear you say it. The Bear. There you go. So, yeah. Staley, that's one for one. Good job. Yeah. All right. So, this next one right here is going to be an uh, ex-coach of ours. Who is this? Dick Buckus. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What, what, what did you just say? <laughs> Who is this? Dick Buckus. Dick Buckus. Was he the coach? Dick Buckus was not the coach. Um, hold on, hold on. I know it. Is this you, sweater vest guy? Sweater vest guy, yeah. Oh, no, what's his name? <laughs> um, Three seconds. Oh, no, no, it's not timed. Hold on, I always talk about him with your dad. You do, you do. We always talk about this guy. Can I have a hint? Are you phoning I, a friend right now? Yeah, like I know who it is, I just can't think of the name. 
Like, I see the name, but I Are can't. you phoning a friend right now? You get one phone the friend. No, I'm not phoning the friend. Hold okay. on. Hold on. Hold Three on. seconds. No, I don't get timed. So it's not Dick Buckus, and it's not, um, what's his name? Hmm. Fine, I'll give you a hint. He was the coach of the Bears' only Super Bowl. Yeah, of the 85 Bears. 85 Bears, baby, yes. I know that, but I'm you, just trying to think of the name. I know who it is. Like, I, I like, visually, I know him. You know him, but you don't know him. The, I just can't you think can't, of the it's, name. It's like, cat you know? got your tongue. Like, yes. You just you can't get it yeah. out. Hmm. Give you one more guess. You got it wrong anyways, but I'll give you another guess just for your for your mind. So well, if I already guess. got it wrong, then I'm not going to guess again. Mike Dicka. No, Dicka. Dicka. Same dick. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, my God. Next. Next. Oh, damn it. I'm pissed. Dang Mike it. Dicka. Dang it. All right. This one, babe. This is a big one. Oh, this no. is a big one right here. Who is this? Who is this? George S. Hollis. Dab it up. Not a girl. Dab it up. Yes, this is George House. So that's what? Two for three now? You like how I threw the S in there? Yeah. Yeah, That because that, that, true Bears fans would throw the S. Like yeah. George. G-S-H. It's, that's why it's on the it's, hat. It, it's, man, I love you. I love you. That, that That's my girl right there, people. That is my girl. You know what's crazy? A lot of people don't know who this is. I do. And this guy is not only the reason why the Bears are around. He's a huge reason why the NFL as a whole is around. So. Him and the Lombardi person. Yes, huh? yes. So we're going to go next, and this is going to be our first player. Are you ready? This, mm-hmm. this is another one. You, Who is this, babe? Brian Erlacher. Brian Erlacher. There we go. Good job. Brian Erlacher. I'm at three right now. Yes, but you better keep track, and don't cheat me. I'm not. I'm at don't three. cheat me. This is obviously a Bears legend. Um, He just got recently into the Hall of Fame, but yes, every Bears fan knows this person. All right, here we go. Now we're going to the past. Here we go. Who is this? Who is this? It seems like she's struggling on these older players. Like when when it's like recent. It's not Walter Payton. This is not Walter Payton. No. Is it William the Fridge Perry? <laughs> is it? Who? The fridge. The fridge. First of all, the fridge was not this small. No, I know. That's why I didn't want to say it. He was way bigger. Fr- oh, whoa, Gale Sayers. Yes, it is Gail Sayers, but unfortunately, you, no, you, you, I can't. No, 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 no. Bella, I no. can come back from it. That's not fair. I can come back. But you said William Perry. I know, but that's only because it was like a black and white picture, and I him, and I always go to him. So, but I got it right. I came back from it, so I get it right. I'm at four. All right, we're gonna leave this up to the Bears fans. Should I she, recovered really fast? Please. She did recover really fast, but comment down below. Should she? Should I give her that pass? Yes. Or. Did she get it wrong? Because she did say William Perry, and that's two different people. I know, but I have recovered really fast. You did recover fast. I I have to give you that. You did recover fast. But we're going to let the Bears fans decide if you should get that point or not. Here we go. So now we're on our next set. Well, that's up to the Bears fans. (laughs) I'm at four. Whatever you say. Here we go. Who is this? It's not Khalil Mack. It's not Khalil Mack. He does play. He's still currently on the Bears right now. It's definitely not. <laughs> we do. Cohen. You know, we. <laughs> Tariq Cohen. Oh I said my it's God. definitely not. Definitely not Tariq Cohen. Tariq Cohen is like my. my oh, side. is this my guy that I always talk about? Which guy? The one that you're. Which guy? I don't know. <laughs> I don't which guy? Say I'm not. It, you're I'm not <laughs> <say it. laughs> who, who do you think? Is it Eddie Jackson? <laughs> Eddie Jackson? Eddie Jackson is a safety, babe. Eddie Jackson's smaller than this guy. Plays two different positions. Do you have this jersey? No, I do not. Oh. I'll give you a hint, okay? See, see, see. technically this is already, you know, a wrong answer. I lost but I'll this get, one. Yeah. You lost this one, but I'll give you a hint. This guy went to Sacramento City College. We talk about him all the time. Uh, Sacramento guy. That's not Lance Briggs. No, there's another guy that was from Sacramento City College. The new guy, but he's on the Bears. I thought he's on the Bears. This is currently on the Bears. Akeem Hicks. Oh, we talk about him all the time. He's from Sacramento City College. He went. Hmm. Yep. Good to know. Akeem Hicks. Akeem Hicks. Number ninety six. Bears fans love Akeem Hicks. That that's that's a good point to make. Sorry to disappoint. (laughs) Here we go. We're going back to the. This guy is a running back. Who is this? There's another guy. Um, Bears legend. Bears. Bears had a lot of good running backs. Is he still currently on the Bears? No, no, he is Mm. now retired. Hmm. Do you have this jersey? Yes, I do. Hmm. I do have this jersey. I have a lot of Bears jerseys. Hmm. 
Hmm. Um. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm saying, she's struggling on these <laughs> on these uh, past players. When when you put out recent players, she's like doing pretty well. Um. Just give me give me an answer. Um. I don't know. Akeem Hicks. <laughs> This is Matt Forte. Oh. Matt Forte. That's Matt Forte. Oh. I've been picturing something completely different. Yes, this is Matt Forte. Once okay. again, ba- I, I try to pick the best players okay. that, that like Bears fans like idolize and stuff. Um, players that we truly, truly do love and, and miss on the Bears. But this is Matt Forte. So Matt you're at Forte. so you're so you're at three. I'm at four. And a questionable four. I'm at four. So you're at three and a questionable four. You're giving me hard ones. Here we go, baby. This is your time to shine. Okay. If you don't get this one, I, I here we go. Who is this guy? Who is this guy? The fridge. Oh my god. This is Dick Buckus. Oh dude. This is Dick Buckus. <laughs> you didn't let me recover. Oh, uh, my bad. This is Dick Buckus. I thought he doesn't look the same. What do you mean he doesn't look the same? Oh, never mind, never mind. I thought Mike Dicko was Dick Buckus. Like, you got you got that mixed up. Yeah, I know. I thought like Dick Buckus was the guy that wore sweater vests, but obviously not. Obviously not. This is Dick yeah. Buckus. Now, okay. now you got a visual. Yeah, man. 51. He's he, big. He, he, <laughs> yes, he is big, babe. Here's the funny thing about, about Maddie is that she – Loves Dick Buckus. <laughs> Every single time you say, "All right, who is this baby?" Like we'll play this game a lot, like just us two, not on the podcast. But she'd be like, "Oh, that's Dick Buckus," yeah, and or Mike Dicka. Or Mike Dicka. <laughs> Those are our two favorite uh, Bears player and coach of all time. So wasn't Mike Dicka a Bears player? Yes, he was. Okay. He was a tight end for the Bears as well. That should be a point for me. No, we're not. Getting, no, no, no. <laughs> extra, hey, extra credit. Th- this is not extra credit. I'm not. No. So this is Dick Buckus. Okay. And like I said, she. I loves. thought Dick Buckus played in like black and white days. <laughs> I guess you could say that it was the 60s. Oh, okay. So, yeah, I guess you could consider this. All right. Are you ready for this? Yeah. Here we go. Another one of your favorites. Who is this? The fridge. This is the fridge. There yeah. you go. Yeah, five. And, 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 and how, you do not have five. Yes, I do. <laughs> you, you, you see, you're just counting numbers no, now. No, I was at four, and now I'm at five. All right. So. That's my guy. Uh, what made you think this is the fridge, though? Because. He's a little big. He's a little big. Is that the only mm-hmm. reason why you think he was the fridge? So I can just put yeah. up any random big person you say the fridge? I would. <laughs> <laughs> I absolutely would. That's heck of funny. So, yes, this is the fridge. Here we go. Next one we got. Who is this? Who is this? All-time great cornerback for the Chicago Bears. Does he still play? No. He won Walter Payton Man of the Year. <laughs> Such an icon in Chicago. Love him. We love him. Everyone knows him. <laughs> No pressure. <laughs> no pressure at all. Um, Why are you trying? Currently, she's trying to look at my calendars and my bear stuff that I have on my wall to see if there's any indication where she can find. Stop cheating. Um, Eddie Jackson. Final answer? No, I don't know. Who all right. Is. This is Charles Tillman. Oh, I have no Sh- idea. You have no idea who I've Charles I've never heard you say that name in my life. So you're blaming it on me. Yes. <laughs> You've never said why, Charles why, Tillman. Why are you blaming to me? on me? Because I always talk about the Bears yeah, around you the talk house. About it nonstop, and I never hear. Oh yeah, Charles Tillman. He's, he's an icon. Never heard that before. <laughs> All right, that was a curveball, but yes, this is Charles Tillman. Okay. Good try, though. Good I'm try. Still at five. You're still at five. Here we go. You you may get these next couple right. Who is this? Come on now. Khalil Mack. This is Khalil Mack. Yes. Yeah. You serious. said that fast. Mm-hmm. Fifty-two. You said, you said that fast. Fifty-two. Mm-hmm. Love him. Khalil Mack. The Mack attack. The worst trade the Raiders could have ever done. Give me that. That's what I'm talking about. Worst trade the Raiders ever. Did we win the trade? Yes. Easily, huh? Yeah, we won that trade. Here we go. Oh, this is another one. Easy. Justin Fields. Justin Fields. And tell people a little stat on Justin Fields. Um, Was it 152? 152? 182? What, what number? What, what number? His, his touchdown passes in college. Like 83 to 86, somewhere around that number. He had like 86 passing oh, touchdowns. Oh, 86 passing touchdowns, yes. In college. We're excited to have him, huh? Yeah. Are you going to get his he's jersey? A, yeah, he's a great asset. Is he? Yeah. What position does he play? Quarterback. Quarterback, easy. Yes. Maddie um, was kind of, as you can see, we had the draft caps on right now. When <laughs> After we drafted Justin Fields, she was like, with the first pick, the Chicago Bears draft Madison, quarterback. <laughs> I don't know why she chose yeah. quarterback, but. Because I run the show. You run the show. All right. So this is Justin Fields. Here we go. Who is this? this oh, one. also that was number seven. Oh, Jay Cutler. Jay Cutler? Now I'm at eight. Well, 
Okay, I can still it, be it, at it, seven. It doesn't really matter because you won. <laughs> you won the challenge anyway. So yeah. this is Jay Color. What? I think you only know Jay Color because he was married to Kristen Cavallari. Yeah. So and they they just went through a messy divorce. They did. They did. But yeah. So but he ended up coming out on top. He did. Jay Cutler is. Sure did. Hey, Jay, Jay Cutler has swag. He's funny. He is funny. He has some swag. So this is Jay Cutler. Jay Here Cutler. we go. You should know this one too. Okay. Easy. This one's easy. This one's easy. 55. Oh, Schmiggy Briggs. <laughs> yes, people. She said Schmiggy because my dog is named. Uh, Briggs. We named him after Lance Briggs. And we call him Schmiggy. And obviously, if you saw on my YouTube channel, Maddie actually surprised me uh, with a video from Lance Briggs when the I graduated. Cameo. Yeah, the cameo video. When I graduated from college, she surprised me with a video from uh, Lance Briggs. Obviously, he's with from a signed football. with the signed football that's up on my bed right now. Uh, obviously, he's from Elk Grove, Sacramento guy, uh, and he was Bears fans loved Lance Briggs. It was him and uh, Brian Urlacher for all those years. Mm -hmm. Those so are fifty four and fifty five. Yeah, those were the guys that I grew up watching as a okay. young Bears fan. So good job. Obviously you guys got already lost, but how about we make a, a make a deal right here. If you get this one wrong, you I take lose. me you lose. You take okay. me on. And this one I don't think you're gonna get wrong. Okay. This one is the easiest one of the bunch. Who is this babe? Walter Payton. Walter Payton. And what was Walter Payton's nickname? Sweetness. Sweetness. I like how you said sweetness. <laughs> so as you guys can tell I'm basically the biggest Bears fan out there. She I know is, everything. Yeah, she knows everything about the <laughs> Chicago Bears. And I'm impressed. Are you? I, I got I, more than half. You did get more than half. And I don't even think it matters if people say you got that last one, the other one wrong, the questionable one. Because you still got more yeah. than half just, right. I can't believe I messed up on my two guys. My yeah, you Ditka messed up on Dicka and Dick Buckets. I don't know how that happens. It's because the last name and the first name kind of sound the same. Ditka, Dick. Ditka and Dick. Yeah. So that's what got you confused. Mm -hmm. And then William Perry, you just look at any big guy and think it's William Perry. Yeah. Because yeah. I'm telling you, like, for the longest time, I thought Dick Buckus was, like, the short little guy that wore sweater vests. But that's Mike Ditka. The coach. The coach. The but, only coach. And that, that's what got me confused because Mike Ditka also played. So I thought Dick Buckus was the coach and was a player, too. All right. I, it's understandable. Hey, congratulations. I'm going to take her out to any lunch she wants. Uh, fair and square, it was a it was a deal. But before we end this episode of Kick on the Mic, do you want to give Bears fans maybe a record prediction for this season? And remember, there's there's 18 games now, or 17. I think it's 17 or 18. I think it's 18 now. 18. Hmm. I'm gonna say. Oh, it's 17 games. My 17 bad. games. 13 four. 13 and four. And what makes you say 13 and four? Guys, I'm feeling really confident this year. You're feeling really confident this year? Is it because mm -hmm. of Justin Fields? Yeah, and 13 is my lucky number. Okay. So 13 and 4, you heard it here first from the world's biggest Bears fan right here, Madison. Babe, thank yes. you so much for coming on to the podcast. Of I really course. appreciate it. I had to, like, drag her on. But <laughs> once I got her on, she warmed up. And congrats on being the, a mega Bears fan. So yeah. and that's a big deal. But before I let you guys go, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell notification to catch all Bears content right here on the podcast. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram page, at Kick on the Mic. And make sure you share this episode of Kick on the Mic with every single Bears fan that you know. But other than that, I'll be back for an all-new Bears podcast right here on Kick on the Mic. Thanks, guys. Now this is a podcast all about Bears. You either cheering for this team or just pulling your hair. Pulling your hair. I like to take a minute and just sit right back and tell you how I became the number one Bears fan. That boy is Benny Hunter. Kick on the Mic, Kick on the Mic. Cake on the mic, cake on the mic. Uh, people, that's the intro. Sacramento, Sacramento, California, born and raised. And Antelope is where I spend most of my days. Most Talk my days. bad about my team, you must be a clown. This is Keek on the mic, so you know you better bear down. Bear down.